everyone and welcome back to Zoo Crafting in Sims 4! We are here with the amazing Iris and Bailey! We're back at their household today because Iris and Tate, who have started dating, have a date today. In fact, you see, they started dating. Today is date day. Oh, that's so exciting. But yes, look at their cute little greenhouse. This is where roommates Iris and Bailey live together. And they live right next door. See, there's at Lily and Tate's house with its adorable. Look at that. Look at that observatory. I am so excited that they have managed to earn their observatory. Oh, that's just so cool. And look at how the house has expanded and been added on to as time has gone on. Oh, I love it. You can see Lily's chess table to the right and the beautiful willow tree that Tate wanted that we had to move because he needed more space in his garden. You can see the observatory that they just managed to afford thanks to all the plant specimens. And there's the plants that have contributed said plant specimens. And they've done such a good job too. Oh, look at the little pomegranate tree. I am so proud of that pomegranate tree. It is the cutest thing ever. And look at these. I never even noticed they had plants in their front yard. Isn't that just so silly? I've been too focused on the amazing, look at it, look at it. That llama topiary. I love that llama. It is just so freaking cute. Uh, and meanwhile, Lily, oh my goodness, or excuse me, Iris. Uh, I keep mixing up my flower names. But Iris has been doing a great job over here. I've actually been playing uh, Bailey and Iris off camera a little bit just so I can get used to the feel of the game and all of the amazing things it has to offer. And our beautiful Iris girl right here, she actually is a really, really good painter. She has been zooming up the aspirations. Um, her little aspiration right here is to become painter extraordinaire. And she has been zooming up there. In fact, look, she's got 1,435 wish points, or let's see, reward points, as they call them in this game. Uh, and my goodness, we really, ooh, I wonder, well, we'll see if we can get her something really cool from there in just a second. But she has already reached the Painter Extraordinaire Brushing with Greatness, which is two out of four level of the Painter Extraordinaire Aspiration. And she's just shot right up. Like, she's had no problem just painting one painting after another. They've got tons of money most of the time because she's just able to churn them out like no tomorrow. And hopefully we'll be able to nail that expressionistic reward trait pretty soon for her because that would be amazing. The expressionistic reward trait makes it so that our lovely, lovely Iris here can paint whatever kind of painting she wants, no matter what mood she's in. Right now she's working on a $100, $100 for the paint in this canvas. Oh, so expensive. But a $100 abstract painting. And she's actually doing a really good job of it. And I mean, look at this. Wouldn't this be so inspirational? I mean, look at that science park. I am still so in love with that science park. I mean, look at the little hedge. The little hedge you can walk under. It's just so freaking cute. Oh, oh, and there's Bailey. Bailey has been doing a good job too. Iris basically comes out here every morning and works on her painting and has a great time. She'll putter around with her flowers that she gathers. Uh, you know, she just kind of gathers and sells the flowers to make some extra money to afford paint or tries making them into paint herself. You can't really do that in the game. That's just what I'm saying for story, just so you guys know. But yeah, she's just, she churns the paintings out. Look, she's already halfway done with this large abstract. She's been doing great, and I mean, it's just is so beautiful. The morning light in this game, as the sun rises over there, it is just, it's so beautiful. Oh, look, and there's some birdies! Oh, I love the birdies! Oh, and look at that cute little car! Oh my gosh, why is that car so cute? That is such a cute little car. And even the fire hydrant! I am just so excited about everything this morning. Oh my goodness. But yes, yeah, so, Iris just comes out here with the beautiful morning sunlight and wiggles her little hips in her cute little outfit and just loves loves painting out here and i can't blame her because this is such an inspirational adorable little porch i am in love with it especially because it has so many plants and it's surrounded by plants oh so cute but to go up the next level of her painter aspiration oh wow she's just splashing paint around there that's adorable and she's feeling creative oh that's so cute but to go up to the next level, one of the things she needs to do is actually view or admire 30 paintings. And you do that by clicking on a painting and click the view interaction. And I thought, what a better date for Iris and Tate to go on than to go to the museum and to be able to view a bunch of paintings. So I think that that is the date that they're going to have today. Since both of them work from home, we don't really need to worry about the time. Though Bailey does need to worry about the time. Oh, what's that little moodlet she just got? confident from completing a painting. Whoa, she's already done? It's good quality. We need 10 excellent quality. So you're getting there. You're getting there, Iris. Let's sell it. 
Off to the collector it goes. There we go. Though we do need to keep about 25 paintings because she wants to put them on display. So that's going to be a lot of paintings to display. Let's have her work on a confident painting just to see what she turns out. Will we spend some time catching up with Bailey? That's the bathroom, not Bailey. Here's Bailey on his little itty bitty computer. He desperately wants a new one. In fact, can we afford a new one for him? Oh man! His just freaking broke! Look at that nonsense! Man, Bailey, just as I was thinking about getting you a new one, did you do that on purpose? Did you do that on purpose? I bet you did that on purpose. Oh. He's like, this is a piece of junk! <laughs> but Bailey actually wants to be fabulously wealthy, and he's doing a really bad job of it right now because he has earned very little money, but he's going up there. He's actually been promoted a few times. He's a code monkey right now. He wants to make a plug-in on the computer. Well, your computer is fried. Can we afford you a nice new one? Let's find out if we can get Bailey a nicer computer. Do -do 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 -do. Electronics. But yeah, he's a code monkey, and he- Ooh! No, 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 no. I can't get you any of those. Um... There's a slablet, but I don't think... Yeah, I don't think that's going to actually... Oh man, can if I sell this, will it do anything? Okay, let's sell it. And we're still a little bit short. Okay. It's time to empty your inventory. Bailey, what the heck? Come on. All right, Iris, you're going to have to help him out. Oh, she's got a couple confident paintings just kicking around in here. What? Let's put them up on the walls. I mean, we might we'll sell the flowers and see if that's enough to get Bailey a new <laughs> a new computer. Oh, wow. I think that actually was enough and the mushrooms too. Bailey, I think Iris just bought you a new computer with her with her painting money. Let's see, computer, computer. <gasps> she did! How close? Oh, yep, we're not going to be able to afford the other one for a while. There you go, sir. Because your computer just broke. Here is a brand new one. That's actually probably going to make him pretty happy because it is a new item. Woo! Where are we going here? That's better. No, hope. There we go. So hopefully that'll make him happy. Program... Uh, make plug-in. What do you think, sir? What? No boost? You just got a brand new computer thrown in front of you. I expect gratitude. Look at that screen. It's like twice the size of your old one. Alright, you work on your plug-in, sir. But yeah, he works on plug-ins and things like that. Iris, you saved the day right there. That was amazing. Let's put up some of her confident paintings so she has more paintings up. Oh, it's so, so cute. It's a little kitten. And that is a lion. Why not? We'll go ahead. It's it's six out of twenty-five of her paintings that she wants up on the walls. I guess we're just gonna like coat at least we've got really high ceilings. We'll just cover the ceilings in her paintings. What's this one? I like it. I don't know what it is yet. It's like an ink blot test. She's feeling confident about it. That's always great. But after she's done, we will invite Tate out for their date, because that's so exciting. They're gonna go on a little date. Oh look at that! And Bailey's got the music turned on. Classic music, no less. Listen to the classical, <laughs> laughing to himself while he makes this plug-in. I wonder what the heck the plug-in ah, does. I'm suspicious. <laughs> How you doing, confident girl? Okay, I'm glad you're confident about that, because I don't know. I don't know about this. Oh, but it's an excellent quality. Good job. Oh, good, 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 good. So we'll let her go to the bathroom. And yeah, this is another excellent quality. So we'll grab this painting. Come here. And maybe we'll stick it up on the wall over here somewhere? Yeah, let's put it over here for now. Uh, up, 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 uh, down a little. No, up a little. There we go. I love that you can adjust them on the wall, like base game. Let's frame the canvas. Ooh, that's looking good. Iris, good job! I would add some lights, but you're out of money. You're totally out of money. Yeah, so we're getting closer. Look at that. Up to 25 paintings uh, on the wall. This is the one she painted after they had their first kiss. So cute. Bailey's going to be going to work soon. That's fine. We're actually... Oh, and that reminds me. Iris! Iris! I downloaded you a new hair, Iris! It's really... Oh my gosh, that sink! Iris, clean that. Oh my goodness. We cannot go out. Why is there a guitar? I think Bailey wanted to learn the guitar. Oh, gross! You can't wash your hands when it's scrummy like that. Like, scrub that thing. Oh, that's so nasty. Clean that. I wish I could hire you a freaking maid. That's better. Oh, and 
Bailey's spleen re reticulation plug-in is second to none. He has earned $13 from the sales proceeds. Living the high life. Living the high life, Bailey. I hope that I hope that you're feeling pretty confident. Looks like he is. He's feeling accomplished. He got his plug-in made. He's listening to some fine tunes, so it boosted his confidence. And actually, that's going to let him maybe get promoted at work today. So good for you, Bailey. Wow. All right. Meanwhile, Iris, let's come over to the mirror, which for some reason we have over here. And we are going to change your appearance real quick because I downloaded a new hair for her. I'm really excited. I saw my very first CC hair. Very excited. I saw it on my Tumblr, my little Simbler that we have. And so many new amazing custom content is coming out for Sims 4. Very excited. So for our adorable little Iris's first date, we're actually going to change her hair up a little bit. Let's see if I can find... Where would the one that I download be? Like, at the bottom? <gasps> there it is! So I'm thinking... Oh, for some reason that just suits her so much more to me. Just, it does. It's like bigger and poofier and just adorable. And somehow that suits her. I don't know, maybe not. It's a little bit bigger than I thought it would be. Um, let's try some things out, Iris, because you are going... Oh, stop turning the hair the wrong color. You are going on your first date date. That's cute. Let's go with that for today. It's so easy to change their outfits. I almost never do this. But I totally am going to start doing it more often because it's fun. It's fun to dress up and be like you're going on your date. You want to wear something cute. What about this? This is cute. Is it Iris though? Oh, that's Iris. Do we have do we have like a little skirt she could wear? Let's see. A little skirt, little skirt. Ooh, 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 I forgot. I could sort by skirts. So exciting. I think she would just wear a different color of the same skirt. That seems like her. There we go. Look how cute that is. Iris, you look adorable. I like the longer hair on her a little bit. Like, the the shorter hair was cute and sporty to start with. But now she's going to grow her hair out. You know, she's a budding artist. And she's, she's in love, feeling a little romantic, which is totally adorable. So we are now going to call up Tate and take him and Iris out to the museum. And I'm so excited. I have not actually been to the museum. Uh, yet. So this is gonna be different. Oh my gosh. Celebratory music just because we came back in from cast. Goodness gracious, it was so loud. But yeah, okay. So now we are going to travel. And we are going to travel to the Municipal Muses Museum. And let's see, can we travel? Yep, there he is. There's our Tate boy. We're gonna travel there. Iris is going to take lovely Tate and they're going to go on their first little date. I'm so excited. And hopefully they can view lots and lots of paintings to help Iris go way up there on her, on her little aspiration. Do, 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 do. And here we are! Look at it! Oh my goodness, it's so cute! Well, sort of plain, actually. I'm a little surprised. Oh wait, I think that's because we don't have a roof on the top. Hang on now. That's better! <laughs> that looks so much better. Wow, and it's really empty. There is no one else here. Goodness. Hello? Hello, other people? Hello? Oh, wow, there they are. <laughs> Everyone's just kind of in a little cluster over here. That's fine, that's fine. Iris! Oh, Iris, you're looking cute. I don't think Tate got the memo that we're going on a date, but that's okay. We're going to suave kiss because she's feeling she's feeling confident. Was that? Oh, wow! Look at that cute little like cut in the back of the shirt. I didn't even notice. Oh, Tate, you're so cute. Talking about llamas for the morning, huh? Oh, and she's happy because they're outside getting fresh air. Let's see, bright and day. Um, express fondness, and then we'll share some creative ideas if we can. Let's see, Bailey's off to work. We'll discuss color theory, and then we're going to go inside. Oh, hey! It's Thatsum again. What's her name again? Casey! That's right, Casey. 
Alright. Oh, what happened? Something, Something happened. Tate's happy. <laughs> okay. Oh, <laughs> and they're lovebirds. In fact, let's give him a little peck. Let's give him... Let's see. Flirt, express fondness. Caress cheek, blow a kiss, propose. <laughs> we're, 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 let's let's kiss his cheek. That looks we're, you know, Iris. You gotta you gotta pace things here a little bit. Oh my gosh! So oh, Tate, I'm so happy for you. I mean, oh, they just look so happy. You know what I mean? He's so big and buff and burly from all of his, like, gathering and everything, but I can see how he would just be happy uh, being with her. So let's go inside. We're discussing color theory. Give him a peck on the cheek. It's time to go inside and look at some of these paintings, because that's something that she needs to do. Come on, you two. Tate, follow along now. Or you can run off and look at look at the fishing. I don't mind if you look at the fishing. Oh, look at this little elder. Look at you, sir. Who are you? Dennis Kim. You look a little familiar. I think I know some of your family. And there's a cute little car is driving by. All right, Tate, come on inside. Oh my gosh, she's doing the confident little strut. She's like, one day, my work is going to be here. I wonder if she can get like her artwork put up in the museum somehow. That would be so cool. That really would. I hope that that's a feature in the future, because I've heard in the expansions they're thinking about, there's all sorts of cool community events, like farmer's markets and stuff. That's one of the potential expansions. Like, you can become the mayor by doing little elections and things. That would be really fun. Okay, how long are you going to have to look at the painting, though? Okay, she looked at that one. She looked at this one. We really do just have to walk from painting to painting and look at things. Tate! Oh, there you go, Tate, Tate. Oh, who's she? I think we've met her before. Megan! Hey, Megan! Apparently, Iris knows Megan. Who else do we have floating around here? Olivia, Zion, Juan, Casey. Casey, I she she's normally pretty depressed, but can we can we chat while this? Oh, good, we can chat while this is happening. Aww. I really need to download the lighting mod so I can see what the heck's going on in here. So they're just looking from painting to painting, and they're chatting while they're doing it. I'm so glad, because it makes it a good date. Oh, that makes me happy. Um, oh, give massage. Make out, share secret. Uh, well, let's brighten day. Tickle, oh, tease flirtatiously, tickle mercilessly, whisper sweet nothings. Hmm. Tease flirtatiously. That sounds so adorable. I want to see what that does. Are you going to tease him? Are you going to tease him? Oh, hey. Oh, hey. I wish I had better lighting in here because what is this cuteness? Look at her little face. Oh my gosh, Iris. Like, I know it's really hard to see because the lighting is so bad, but look at her little face. She's so cute. And Tate just is gazing at her with such adoration and love. And it's just, oh, I love it. She's like, hey, is she teasing him? What kind of, what kind of, like, silly little, little things are you teasing him about here? Oh, look at that. Oh, he's so happy. Give him a kiss. Give him a little kiss. Oh, little peck peck. Oh, so cute. Go ahead and view some more paintings. He's walking around, probably going to the bathroom or something like that. What is upstairs? Oh, wow. There's not even a bathroom up here. What the heck? There's a lot of paintings, though. Oh, Tate likes the statue. I could see Tate liking this statue. That makes sense. That makes sense to me. Oh, look, there's some kitties up here. There's some jazz stuff going on. Hey, now. I kind of want to get in. Oh, look at the little the little ship thing. I like the little model ship. This is fun. This is fun. I like looking at art. In real oh, look at the chicken. Let's look at the rooster. <gasps> I love chickens. Lily, or Iris. Iris, I need to stop calling you Lily. If I give all of your children, like, flower names, I'm doomed forever. I'm just going to be mixing them up all the time, which is highly ironic since I'm named after a plant in real life. But such is life. Oh, and look at the little violins. All right, look at everything. Oh, and look at the plant. Can you look at the plant? Oh. Plant is art. I don't care what people say. Plant is art. Let's see. There's a little little bar if we wanted to mix a drink. There's a little like piano if we wanted to listen to piano. 
Oh, she's happy because everything's nicely decorated and she's feeling good. My goodness, it takes a while to like look at all these things. Okay, let's look at this one. Uh, do these? Oh, look at that flower plant painting. We're gonna look. We're gonna look, and we're gonna admire. Oh, look at! Oh, <laughs> look at the little puppy! Oh, it's so cute! I love it! I like it! I like how it's over here. And this is a beautiful bust. Oh my goodness! Look at that, gorgeous! I love how they did the shadow, like just the artistic little shadow on it. Very stylized, like the rest of everything. All right, come on, come on, scooch it. Next painting, next painting. But yeah, we're gonna look at everything that this place has to offer because this museum is going to be replaced with another museum from the gallery for the next time that Iris is gonna come out and look at museum things. So we'll have a different community lot and a different everything to look at, which should be kind of interesting. There's, oh, Tate's just making friends. Come on, Iris. Can I, can I, if I, if I cancel it, can I just scooch you from one to another? Have you looked at that one? I think you've looked at that one. Maybe that's why it's not doing something. Does it have to be a different painting every time? All right, come over here. Come over here. Ooh, this one looks kind of like, oh, you know what we haven't done yet? We haven't gone to Oasis Springs yet. Going to Oasis Springs is definitely going to be on our list. Definitely going to be on our list of things to do. All right, so. Tate's make it downstairs making friends. This is good for him. He focuses a little bit too much. I can't believe I'm saying this, but he focuses a little bit too much on being outdoors. And sometimes he just is him and his fishing rod for weeks straight. Oh, he's passing out. Dang it. So it looks like he's going to head home soon, I bet. But he's here now looking at things and visiting with people, which is going to really help him out. Hmm. So I would say this is a, this is a pretty good date. And if he's going to pass out and go to sleep pretty soon, who's this? Look at this little girl. Look at this little cutie patootie. Olivia Spencer Kim Lewis. Just sitting here doing her homework, her grade school homework, and her little paint splattered jeans. That is the cutest thing I have seen all day. That is adorable. All right, how are you going up here? You doing good? She's still viewing the paintings, doing a good job. But I think we'll kind of end the date because Tate is, like, you can see he's physically becoming more tired. So let's come downstairs. Romance. Um, oh, I thought we were on a date. I guess we weren't officially on a date. Ah, okay, so this was more a casual outing. Uh, let's embrace. And then come down here. And... Profess undying love is kind of strong. Let's just go with uh, hold hands. You know, they gotta take it nice and steady, not not too fast. And then they can cheer and then they can Oh, look, there's a painting we missed. I'm glad I put the walls up. Gotta track all these puppies down. Hang in there, Tate. He's like, I'm so tired. I'm so snoozy. We'll let him go home, and then I will finish up with making her look at all the paintings, because that's not too interesting. They're kind of cute, but, you know, we've seen them. There. Hold his little hands. Oh, wow. Give him a little kiss. Little kiss kiss. Okay. Ooh. ooh. Give him a passionate kiss. Now see, she's feeling flirty. And then flirt with him. Um. Whoop. There they go. Passionate kiss. Goodness. Flirt with him. She wants to flirt with him. He's like, wow. Oh, wow. They just got their relationship to another level. Suggestive conversation. What? What kind of relationship are they in now? <gasps> Soulmates? Oh, that is the most sweetest thing in the world. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I think we might we might be moving their relationship along pretty quickly soon. I think that they need to get a house with Lily. I don't know if Bailey would move in with them, but I, I think Lily and Tate are kind of a package deal. <laughs> but we need to save up to get a, a house for them to like move into. Level up charisma skill. That's not. Okay, sexy pose. Okay, we'll do one sexy pose because I want to see what this is. She's like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Catch some of those big fish, big boy, and sell them so you can get your own house, please. All right, and then we'll go ahead and kiss him one more time. And then, then we will end it here. 
Their relationship, no matter where it is, is definitely taking off. They are soulmates now. That is the sweetest thing I have seen. I am going to help her. Oh, look, there's another one I missed. I'm going to help her look at the rest of the paintings so that we can at least complete that little view or admire 30 paintings thing. And then we will go back to Lily and Tate's so that we can figure out a way for those two to totally like churn out the money so that hopefully we can get Tate, Iris, and Lily moved into a new house. Bailey, I don't know if we'll move into like a house because he's not that close to them. He's friends, but if right now I'm just feeling like I want to move the trio into a home together and then let these two perhaps start a little family together. <gasps> While we watch Lily as she goes off to space and who knows what she'll do. So that's going to be exciting. Maybe she'll go on to have her own life in the future. But for now, I'm going to, I'm just going to let this end here. So I will see you guys next time. Oh my goodness. Where we've got this romance really charging along. So now we need to be responsible adults and get the house that they can move into. Very exciting. I will see you guys then. Bye-bye.